What up, and this is John's your boy, IBS Kelso, coming back with another MX Bikes Banger. Now, before you adjust your phone brightness or change your monitor settings, yes, I am black from playing a dirt bike game. Now, today, we are giving you the Fantic 250 setup, and uh, yeah, we're here on Club. I think this is an EU uh, Club. Yeah, EU Club ranked uh, server. I just want to always, as always, I want to show these in ranked aspect or racing aspect, just to show you like the environment to say that it can compete against other bikes and, and ranked. And that's usually where you want to race it, right? And or other servers. But with that being said, like and subscribe. Shout out to Mints. Huge thank you to Mints. Um, the only thing I tweaked on here, his setup was completely fine. The only thing I tweaked on here was, be, I guess, because within my own setting was a swing arm. He had it at four and I changed it up to six. Um, the reason why I changed it to six was because I just couldn't turn the bike I literally couldn't turn the bike, but I changed it to six and it completely worked for me So yeah, we're gonna get right into it. I say that What's crazy is that the Fantic 450's honestly been going crazy for everybody <laughs> The Fantic 450's been going crazy and I heard that it's a really great bike I can't wait to really touch it. I haven't really done too much work on it, but shout out to uh, breezy uh, he he said he just runs stock on it and he only changed the tires and that bike runs amazingly smooth So shout out to breezy if you're watching this But on top of that his the big brother works completely fine But I'm gonna say that the little brother Fantic 250 man this thing's running man It kind of gives me the sound mod kind of gives me the uh, the Yamaha 250 vibes uh, Gearing's not completely like the Yamaha, but it's perfect and like I always say, you know Gearing has nothing to do with it. You can always change the gearing to whatever you're liking if you're not a huge changing gears guy or you're not a huge uh you're not a huge uh like long gearing person you like more of the aspect of changing gears a lot so i would say you know personal preference but the only thing i did change was the was the uh swing arm and uh so far i can turn this bike completely and it feels super plant uh, planted now i really haven't rolled the fantic for i mean 250 at all before like the old patch and then this new patch i literally just jumped on it when he gave me <laughs> the setup and i will say i like it dude it's it's up there for a 250 for me it doesn't feel like it's super op and it doesn't feel like it's super slow but it feels like it's right there in that race pace slash super speed and you're there dude it, it feels nice bro i'm not gonna lie so definitely pick it up man like i was always i'm hopefully i hopefully i tri uh trickle through this the whole setup through before the you know race is over and uh yeah but i saw that there's not too many liv liveries made for this bike man like what the heck did you guys are not showing too much love and i feel like i feel bad because i haven't shown this bike too much love and it actually is freaking amazing dude so shout out to that dude honestly this bike is is dope i actually can't wait to try the 450 fantic um but w to the oem team man they, they made this bike really nice i really didn't even try it last oem so i really couldn't compare it but I know this bike is sick. I mean, we're out here with a 17 point lead gap. I mean, I don't really know if there's anybody fast in here, but dude, this bike literally just came from the start to like go into the finish. So I don't even know what we're about to run right now, but we're, we're cooking. We are cooking and, and look, look, like it feels amazing, dude. Like, holy moly. What did we just run? A 101 point like one, man. We, we got those 101s in the bag, man. We're trying to. Oh, all right. That was on me. I turned a little bit too hard right there. So I'll take that one. I'll take that one for sure, but hey, Fantic 250. Uh, honestly, I might be running this bike a little bit more closer to the uh, to the Kawasaki. So right now, I say the Kawasaki and KTM is really up there for me, but I think I might have to put so far this uh, Fantic up there. Now, the TM will be tomorrow. Um, thank you guys so much for the support. I think we just hit 2,200 subs. So if you guys have, have not yet hit that sub button, you guys are enjoying all these setups, man. You guys. I hope you guys believe at this point we are a trusted source. I have nothing but great feedback coming back from all these setups. Um, 450s are coming soon, I promise. I know there's a lot of 450 riders out there and you guys are fiending. And I hope that we are a good source for these setups. Um, once again, I'm nobody big in this community, but I want you guys to know that, you know, we, we, we want to give you great, great quality bikes and great content instead of bad content and bad bikes. So we don't want to put a bad name on us. And shout out to Mince, man. He's He's been working his ass off, dude. Straight up, word to your mother. He's been working his ass off on all these bikes, dude. So hope you guys enjoyed the Suzuki yesterday. Hope to, hopefully you guys enjoy this Fantic. And hopefully you guys enjoy the TM tomorrow. Um, I, he, he's unstoppable. I want to do the Gas Gas, man. And it's it's every day that I start making these, I low-key feel like you guys want a Gas Gas. But my own opinion to it is that you guys literally... <laughs> it's, just, it's just like a juiced up bike. It's like... It's like, I feel like the gas gas now is like the YZ, you know, the Yamaha 450. Like, 
everything was juiced into the YZ and now they just juiced everything into the gas gas and it feels bad I feel bad for it you know it's basically just a whole, whole new do-over you know you just pick the whole new bike for the meta but hey to each your own man I'm not gonna dwindle and you know dwell on that too much so we'll, we'll keep going with the bike you know um, with that being said, honestly, I wouldn't even know where you would pick up a Fantic. I've never even heard of a Fantic until I started playing this game. Um, is a Fantic more of a UK thing? Oh, crap. Now, if that gives me 50 seconds of cuts, I'm gonna probably pop a gasket, which it probably will. I, I, I just need to reset. 50 seconds of cuts, and track not clear. 50 seconds of cuts, but we'll see what's up. We'll see what's up. That's probably 50 seconds of cuts for sure. <laughs> what, what kind of luck is that? Oh, wow. No cuts! <laughs> Dude, you caught me, bro. I promise you I would have thought that was 50 seconds of cuts. But hey, I don't know where you can pick out of a Fantic. I believe this is like a UK version thing. Um, right? This is like a European thing. So if it is, I look you want to try this bike at IRL. I don't know if these are really goaded or not. But the Fantic feels great. Um, I can't wait to move on to the TM. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll catch you in the absolute next one. It's your boy IBS Kelso. Pa 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 pee.